not arbitrary. It evolves from real things. Gernrich, who passed away seven years ago, hit his prime as a designer during America's sexual revolution. Responsible for such innovations as the topless bathing suit, the unisex look, and the pube bikini, Gernrich's creations did more than just turn heads, but served as inspiration for an entire generation of designers. I know he has influenced everyone from Yves Saint Laurent to Fredericks of Hollywood. That's a pretty broad spectrum. Acting as inspiration to the designer through most of his prolific years was model and friend Peggy Moffat, who came to symbolize the Gernrich look of the 60s. Highly devoted to the man who made her a somebody, Moffat continues to grandstand Gernrich's designs nearly 30 years after their creation, and recently published a book that not only documents his life's work, but her own unique approach to modeling. You are cropped. You, you either have all of that space, or you have, right now, you are cropping me, I think, somewhere in here. Well, then I started to think, how do I, how do I design that space? Although it seems typically 60s, the main reason Gernrich enjoyed using Moffat as a model was her ability to interpret his designs through action. And nowhere is this better illustrated than in Basic Black, the 1967 film considered the forerunner of all fashion videos. He would give me a dress, I would respond to it as, an, as, an, as a performance. I would say, who is that dress? Is that dress? a vampire kind of lady, or is that a raggedy Ann doll? And it would give me something to do, rather than to think about how uncomfortable I am pretending to be pretty. <laughs> Terrific. Yeah. Good. So as a model, I try and pick up on what a dress makes me do. And I try to be litmus paper to clothes. In the 60s, many people made dramatic statements with their looks, yet few have racked up the mileage points Moffat has accumulated over the last three decades by sticking so firmly with hers. I know it's funny for me to tell you that what my look is is the natural look, but it is for me because it is of my nature. I would adore looking like Candy Bergen, but I know that I would wind up still looking like this if my if my visage was Candy Bergen, because my soul is, is Peggy Moffat. And Peggy Moffat likes to tinker around and doodle on her face and, and do graphic things and make strong statements that she believes in. Mm -hmm. 